So friends, let's start today's lesson. Last time we made this stencil on fake skin and placed it on it. So today we will practice the line on this fake skin with the machine and you will see how to practice writing on the fake skin. And for this I am using our L9 needle, and the pen machine is from Falcon. I am running this machine on 8 volts. May be visible in the camera. Look at the needle, how much spring is coming out. If it seems to be too much, then put the needle inside a little, otherwise the ink will start spreading on the fake skin. While working on the fake skin, keep in mind that the direction of the skin should not be changed. If you are practicing keeping the fake skin like this, then you have to keep it like this. Or if you are keeping it like this, then you have to practice like this. Will not change its direction again and again. And whenever you practice, take Vaseline or AND ointment with you. And practice by applying it on the fake skin. Otherwise there will be a lot of difficulty in cleaning the fake skin. Keep the tissue with you and apply Vaseline on the place where you want to move the needle. The needle has to be immersed in the ink cup so much that only the needle is immersed. Don't fill too much ink inside the ink tank, otherwise the ink will spread on the whole fake skin and there will be problem in practice. Now let us start, we will not start from edge, you can start from any side. First we will make flow by hand and then start making line, have to start very slowly, there is no hurry. First make flow and then start, make line slowly and make line by balancing hand, hand should not move. And the fake skin has to be cleaned by tapping, not rubbing. Now we will make a similar line from the other side as well, and we'll start making a line by creating a flow. We'll make the whole line later. Don't move your hand up or down, otherwise the line will get thicker or thinner, that's why depth has to be maintained. So that's how we'll make all the lines. Vaseline has to be applied again and again to clean the tired extra ink on the fake skin. The hand has to move slowly, and the practice has to be done properly. Often new artists do not practice properly and use fast hands, then the line comes very weak. Then job they make tattoo on real skin then the line is weak and after healing the same line or tattoo gets faded. So it is important to take care of speed and depth while practicing the line.
Now see here a problem is coming, because of the area work here, the fake skin is jumping due to which the line could not be formed properly. That's why whenever you practice, you will hold the fake skin with the other hands so that the fake skin does not jump. I am showing you by making a video, so I am making a video by keeping my hand on the side, so that you can see properly while making the line, but you have to practice by keeping your hand on the fake skin. We have completed the lines, now let's clean the fake skin properly by applying Vaseline. You see how I'm doing, do not use green soap or blue soap here, otherwise there will be a problem in cleaning. After cleaning, we will know that the line has not become weak from anywhere if the line is weak, we will fix that line by recreating it. Second time, when we will make the line, this time we have to control the pressure of the hand, do not apply too much pressure. Otherwise the fake skin will be damaged, because the skin is already torn from there, and if we work again at the same pressure, then the skin will get damaged. It should not be like this, it is fake skin, if it gets damaged then it is okay, but if real skin gets damaged then it will be wrong. Now in the same way we will make the second design, and the line has to be drawn exactly like that. This time the line is not to be completed in one go but to make a smaller line. You watch my wrist movement, how am I running the machine? First I made a half line because the line is big so you can make a line in half as well. This time, when you continue the line, you will start a little behind and complete the line. If you draw a line like this, no joint or dot will come in between.
This time the line will be made complete in one go. So this time the movement of my hand will change. You see how I am moving my hand. I am moving the whole hand only, not the wrist, running my hand along the line. So you can draw a line in this way also. There are both ways. You can practice as you want. It is your wish. Just the line should come right. So in the same way you will make all the lines. Now we will make the net part of it. We will make this also like we have made other lines. Let me tell you that it is easier to make a rounded line than to make a straight line. Now here also the same problem is coming. The fake skin is jumping. So such a problem can come. That's why you will practice by holding the fake skin by hand. The practice of the line has to be done correctly, repeatedly. If there is a short line in the realistic tattoo, then it is not known. But it will not work in line tattoos, such as modeler tattoos, name tattoos, tribal tattoos, armband tattoos. The clearer the line in such a tattoo, the better the tattoo will look. That's why you have to practice. So you have to practice in this way, practice as much as you can, make different desings, have to fill the entire fake skin by practicing, you can practice for to five fakes completely or you can do more, you have to practice until you feel that now your line is being made correctly. You have to practice in slow speed only, do not practice at high speed in the starting, your hand will tremble a little while practicing in slow speed, but do not panic as you practice. The shaking of the hand will automatically reduce. If you are new then it is not necessary that the dark line will come at once. Initially the line will be faint. The negative point of your being new is who knows what will happen. I will try. It is possible that you will move your hand to fast and keep the depth of the needle too low. Or will keep the depth too much. So, we have to keep the needle depth neither high nor low. I will tell you what will be its negative point. If you have kept the depth less then the line will be faded. If you have kept more depth then the line will be dark, but the skin will get torn, damaged. Even if you keep the speed fast, the line will appear faint, that is why the hand speed has to be kept slow. Now if you keep the hand speed normal then the line will come correctly. So it is important to keep this in mind. I can see how in this line, I had kept the depth of the needle more. So how the needle is passing through the fake skin, this is 1 meter and fake skin. If the needle goes to deep then this will happen. You look at this diamond, 
how few needles have gone into the fake skin here. The needle has gone too far into little space, it hasn't gone to that much depth. If it goes so deep, the skin will be damaged, a little will do, this is one millimeter fake skin, so you have to take care of the depth. Now I will show you the rest of the design as well, but if not in a little speed, otherwise the video will be very long. So friends, all the lines have been completed, and in this way you have to practice. See you in the next lesson.